Okay, so today we're going to test our fake awry um, Casey Stoner helmet. Now this is Casey Stoner 27, but Casey Stoner wore a Nolan helmet, not an awry. So this is a fake one from China. This cost around 50 Australian dollars. So we're going to test it. Um, on our mannequin here, a lot of people test helmets and they put the helmet on the ground and then they drop weights on it. But that is not a good way to test a helmet because your helmet is never sitting on its rim and then all the compression goes onto the top. So we're going to test the helmet as you would wear it on a motorbike. So we're going to put it on our dummy and then we're going to hit it on the top, in the shield, on the sides as per how you would normally have impact. So we'll start by hitting the visor. So, put the helmet on our dummy. We'll take the stickers off. This has got two stickers on it. Uh. We'll leave the visor down. Righto, Nancy, you need to move away. Right, thank you. We'll start with a piece of wood because that's a light impact and then we'll see what it does. Nancy, move up behind Mum. Go. So we'll start just hitting it in the front. Okay. No serious damage and another one. Everything still seems to be working. We'll try one more. Okay. Uh -oh. So that's just broken, broken the side. A <laughs> quite Cheers. Righto. Ready. I think this is just broken. This is just the strap from the side. So I think we can actually screw that back in. I think it's okay. I think it just needs. You're still feeling this or not? Mm -hmm. Alright, so that just popped out. So that actually held. Righto, let's try our... Our, our dummy broke its neck. <laughs> Righto, so now we'll try this helmet. This is a tanked racing helmet. This actually has EC approval. So let's see how this one goes with the visor. Nancy, move away. Come to mummy now. I want to get out of the hole. No, move no. to mum. Come. Jump down. Get to mum. Right here. So with the visors, go over. Okay, so the vent in the front of this visor popped out. And the Gropo mount came off. Righto. Here be it, none. What's this? Go up back. No, 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 no. Sorry. So the next, the next test is we're going to hit it with a steel bar. And we'll see what damage it does. So... I think we'll hit on the side here where it says awry. Okay, that's just chin. Okay, 
guy that's just the glasses. Come and have a look at the helmet. The helmet's not really getting any marks or anything on it. I think I have to hit it harder. Right, Nan, move back. Still nothing. Back, back. Nah, back. Not a real lot's happening. Alright, I'll try hitting it extra hard. Okay, the vents come off the back. Okay. The lining a little bit. Okay, the helmet's not it's still not getting down here. You still steal that okay? <laughs> still hard stuff. The helmet's still okay. Oh, okay. We've got a crack here. We've got yeah. one one crack. Let's just let's hit it on the same crack again and see what happens. Okay, the helmet's definitely cracked open. I'll try it again. I'll keep going. Second hits cracked the helmet. This is an EC approved helmet. That only took two hits. The other one took about five hits. <laughs> this helmet has done the same. Pull our head out. If you have a look inside here, all the foam inside the helmet's broken. And the helmet's broken in there. In two places, a big crack here. Yeah, I can see it. So this one here. Still quite strong. Yeah, but still quite strong. So this one's cracked here. And that seemed to crack easier than the than yeah. the other one. And this one here. So really speaking, 
both helmets were about the same. So whether it was the EC approved helmet or this fake Orion helmet, both of them cracked. If anything, this one was actually a bit tougher. So should you buy a fake Orion helmet? Why not? <laughs> All right, that's it. All good. Done. Recycle. Come take the photo. So you can see both helmets.